Hi, um, God, so much has happened for reasons that I don't really want to go through into on YouTube. I no longer live at home. Me and my sister moved into a another flat in. Well, yeah, we just moved, we, we moved house anyway. Um, and I love this bed. Look at the quilt. But it's like this. It's like, I love it. Double bed. That's just I just I love like leopard pretty things. I have to be like got like, this on. It's attached to the dress. Um, I have these which are my pyjamas that have things on, my slippers have them on. I didn't realise I had so much stuff with leopard print on until I like unpacked everything and thought, oh my god, there's like tons of stuff with the door on. Anyway, that's not what this is all about. Um, yeah, do you know how small the room is actually? I have no bookcase and all my books are... There's my coat on the floor there, but... I can turn my computer around. I have books there, and I have books down there, and some of, there's a couple of books that are mine that are down there. Most of them are my sister's, but some of them are smaller, and they just know where to put them. Oh, I had, I had two black bags full of books that I threw out. I felt horrible. I was like. I don't want to read them out. It was just that was the hardest thing I've had to do. Fair enough, I could throw bits and pieces out, like some pairs of socks that I'd never worn, or a pair of trousers that, although I'd never worn them, I absolutely loved them, so I threw them out no problem. I was throwing out DVDs that I never watched, or like putting them back for the charity shop anyway. And um, but the books are thinking I can't do it. That's the hardest thing I've had to do. Um, what's the Smith up there? I forgot I put a Smith on one of the um. Picture hooks up there. I just looked up and it was just there. Give me a bit of a Anyway, so I moved house and and that was like last Saturday and I'm still tripping over things and most everything's unpacked. Most things are. Um, it's just like little bits ago. I saw like a bag of videos. What the hell? Oh, I just had the most horrific thunderstorm. It was horrible. I was already trying to live and thinking, I don't want to go. I'm scared of it. It was just really, really loud. Um, and my sister needs to go to the toilet. And she's like, will you come with me and stand outside the door? Because I don't want to go on my own. I was like, yes, because I don't want to be my own either. Um, but anyway, and also today is the... 5th of August, it will probably be tomorrow or sometime in the end week when I actually upload this, but today filming this right now is the 5th of August and it's this particular date that's really got me thinking because it was a year ago today that at 3.37 in the morning my mum passed away, last, this time last year, yeah, well this today last year, 3 o'clock in the morning. 3.37 in the morning um, and it got me thinking about like my funeral I know that sounds way way off but it was my mum's funeral today but it was the day she died so I was thinking when I die what's my funeral going to be like and I was thinking why a funeral so upsetting I mean yeah someone I know it's because someone's died and well, it obviously isn't going to be upset that someone you care about, someone you love, dead. But shouldn't it be a celebration of your life and how you were, and what amazing things you achieved or what you didn't achieve, what you were aspiring to be? And so I made three rules, three rules for my funeral. I don't care what happens the day before, the day after, whatever. If you want to get upset, that's perfectly fine. But when you're in my funeral. Which hopefully won't be for a long time. Touch wood, touch wood, touch wood. Um. Yeah, three rules. One, no black at all. You can't wear black socks. You can't wear black jewelry. You can't wear black underwear. Your clothes can't have black on them. Just no black at all whatsoever. No one is allowed to have the colour black on any part of their body. 
If you have black hair, obviously that doesn't count. Oh my god, my screen's going off. Something like that. And it just no black at all. The only black you allowed is black hair, and obviously if you have a pair of glasses that have black that you desperately need to see with. But apart from that, no black. At all. Number two, absolutely no crying. I know that sounds stupid because there's a bunch of people weeping their eyes out and crying because they love me so much. But in the room, when the room was on, there was to be no crying. At all. I hate people getting upset over me. I, I, I just hate it. I don't want people to be upset. And number three, no sad songs. Ever. Ever? That wasn't the right word to use, but no sad songs. Just none. I want songs like I'm Still Standing. Actually, yeah, that's what I want playing at my funeral. It's this point in time and I'm Still Standing. The Glee version one with Artie and Quinn. Quarty. But yeah, I'm still standing. Because I am still standing. I'm just not going to be some standing somewhere you can see me. I'm just going to be around following you and looking after you all. Doing all the good in the world. Um, so yeah.